Man, could you imagine being Dave S's husband, having to come home to that every day? Hmm? <laughs> We're gonna do this. All right, so um, over the year, many of you guys have left great comments and we're actually now able to start responding to them. But uh, some of you have left some pretty nasty ones. So apparently someone thought it'd be a good idea for us to go through the na all the nasty comments? Some. Some nasty comments, not all of them. We, can, we don't have time for all of them. So here we go. But let's start with the first one here. Uh, Dale. Dale says, must work by the hour, eight minutes before talking about the subject. Okay, I can handle that. That was on my video. No, that was on me and Eric. All right, that was Eric's fault, man. He talks a lot. Okay, no problem, Dale. Uh, good point there, but that, uh, that show is just kind of a hangout kind of a show, so there we go. Okay, here we go. Let's see what I got. Curious, have you ever... <laughs> this, this guy... Curious, have you ever had to wear a neck brace? Just wondering if they had to stack and duct tape them together for them to work. Man, I do have a long neck. I mean, it's a, like if I do this, you know, I mean, I, as a kid, I wasn't called giraffe boy or anything else though. So I'm, I'm okay with it. Oh man, you gotta, I gotta talk about Tim. It says, oh my goodness, this is such a welcome change. Let's keep Dustin tucked away in the dungeon from now on. Welcome to the team, Eric. I read Eric's but it was kind of against me. Tim, all right, man, we're gonna change it. So now Eric will be your advisor. Anyone who takes financial advice from strangers on the internet, whose name rhymes with, ho oh, ho, oh, our name doesn't even rhyme with that though. Like why, our name is Jazz, not, not with an I. Rhymes, what? Okay, so this is just an example of, of someone who's still living at home with mom and he doesn't want to type in front of the computer while she's there. Mom stepped out to go get some groceries or something so she can make lasagna for him. And he's like, all right, now I'm going to type something. I'm going to go after him. And Jazz Wealth, that's the people I'm going to go after. So good for you for number one, watching a financial video while your mom's out because you could be watching other stuff. And But also, what grade are you in? Nobody ever taught you how to rhyme. Finance is going to be hard for you. Says, if you're gonna get that British guy to do an intro, you ought to go ahead and try to get that young skinny kid in y'all's older videos to make a couple videos too. And by the laughing face there, I'm gonna guess you mean me from years ago. You see what you guys do to me with the wrinkles and the, and the hair and stuff? That's, that's funny, but nah, I've seen funnier, you know what I mean? And plus your icon's a skeleton there. Trent P, great video, Eric. Maybe just me, but you and Dustin starting to look alike in front of that mic. <laughs> Is he growing on you? Really? Me and Dustin looking alike? Come on, man. I, I know I'm better looking than that old looking guy. <laughs> in some reality somewhere, winning, that's funny and disturbing that you actually make that claim you don't live in reality anymore. Oh, is the Fed winning? It was on the short term thing there. Hey. They're still winning. I don't know what you want. Uh, you may want to believe that they're not winning, but the Fed's actually winning at the moment. I could be proven wrong, but so far so good. So uh, crypto people, y'all want the Fed to fail. Another one from Swamp Rat. Why does Eric, first of all, Swamp Rat, really that name? Come on, come on, Swamp Rat. Why does Eric get all the bot replies and you don't? Yeah, that's right, Dustin, why, why don't you? Is it his squeaky voice that calls him out? <laughs> we need to fatten him up some. Uh, so if I get fat, then that means that I won't have a squeaky voice. Is that is that the case? And what's bad is I've had a bad cold. And so um, I probably actually sound a bit squeaky in this video. <laughs> oh, that's a, that's a good one. <laughs> uh, True Caller says uh, seven minutes wasted. Seven minutes wasted on four ways to grow a Roth IRA. How, what? What did you miss? Maybe because he didn't turn the volume on or something? You gotta you turn it up so you can hear. Yeah, and it took him seven minutes to realize that he wasted. <laughs> That's a good point. Bearded BMW guy says, Jesus, this was confusing. And then Tim says, this guy is all over the place. Man, ah, this video, pay off mortgage or invest. I guess that was confusing. I guess that was all over the place. I, if you know me, maybe that's a little normal. I think if you ask Dustin, Cody, Cody, what do you think? Mike, a little bit scattered, 
just bouncing around. A lot of information coming out at once. A lot of information at once, you know. I have a long neck because Swamp Rat, it supports this massive brain that has all these creative ideas up here for your dough. So that's what that's about. So uh, sorry, it was a little bit all over the place for you there. Dave S. Oh, this will be good. Uh, these are so boring where you just fumble around. It shows when there's no thought or planning out into the videos. It's like you are bored and having nothing to do but making videos and you just wasted everybody's time. Um, and then we responded back, oh wow, you're brutal. And he called us a snowflake. Could you imagine being Dave S's husband, having to come home to that every day? Hmm? <laughs> I'm not doing that again.